Hi, uh, my name is Barbara Oliver Hartman. I live in Flower Mound, Texas. And this is my piece, Backyard. And it was something that I just made for fun. My process is, um, I've done a series of quilts for about 25 years that are made from scraps from previous projects. I cut them into small pieces and so everything here is totally recycled, or I guess the new thing is upcycled, but it's uh, all recycled scraps that could easily end up in the landfill. And it was just a really fun thing to do. What I did was I went out in my backyard and I have a large, I have a couple of acres and there's some interesting shaped trees in the very back and they are really scrub mesquites. They're not great trees, but they're interesting. I took pictures of them and they were pretty far apart. And so I took pictures. I knew I wanted to do something with non-traditional colors. And so I had these two trees that are fairly far apart and I brought them together just because I like the shape. I knew I wanted to do different colors for the tree trunks and make it a little bit whimsical. So I named these, this is Dolly and this is Ginger. And uh, I did the background first. Then I added in this tree because Dolly, because she, uh, with this light color, I thought it would really come forward and, uh, dominate. So then I started doing the other one, Ginger, and she just took over. So it was, it was just a fun process. It was something I really enjoyed doing. It was fun. My background is I have sewed my whole life. My mother owned a dressmaking company when I was a little girl. And uh, she had ladies that sewed for her that she took, you know, the business end of it. And so I always knew how to sew. And I got busy with life. I always did sew a little bit, but it was more in the garment area. And then about 40 years ago, I just thought, you know, I don't, I don't like this garment thing, I, but I want to be creative. And my grandmother made quilts. And so I bought a pattern and um, started making a quilt that I never finished. And I just went, I'm not following any patterns anymore. And I've just been improvising ever since. And it's been about 40 years. And this medium is very labor intensive. So we are sitting there doing, so when we come together, we come to see something like this or even get the catalogs from other shows. It's, it's inspiring, it's amazing, it's fulfilling, it's great.